Hey, hi, hello, hello. This week's vlog starts in Sarasota, Florida and ends in Miami. But I'm just gonna voice over the beginning because the reason I'm in Sarasota was to do a week long intensive work session with my boss. I was staying at her house, which was so lovely. And the days literally just consisted of working, going for walks, visiting the beach, going to get a yummy food outside, running our sessions and just a lot of very intense work so there wasn't that much to vlog okay tell me why so i called i'm just sitting in linda's car she's got an appointment so i'm, I'm just here like a little dog we just had this like call about visas and about like how i can get over here and who i need to talk to and whatnot it was really good oh i'm so inspired being over here i don't want to leave america like, i literally i don't know where i want to live if it's not america like i'm not going back to new zealand absolutely not going back to new zealand I could go to England, but it's cold. I like the US. Unfortunately, your girl did get really run down at South By and had to take these vitamin C sachets every morning and I definitely didn't take them like a champ. I absolutely love my job because in what world is a like week long intensive, like you get to go to the beach, you get to explore Florida, you get to eat yummy Florida food. Like so incredibly grateful that I got to experience this and that we got so much work done whilst enjoying it too. Like we went out to dinner, we got to drive in Linda's Porsche to dinner around Florida. It just truly was like manifesting my dream life. So filled with gratitude. I didn't film anything today, but we've been working and some naps because I wasn't feeling great. Called Sam because he got back from LA, had the best time, which is awesome. And now we've been out for dinner at Italian. Just met some lady in the line called Dana, who just was the sweetest lady of all time. She was just this random lady and she loves New Zealand because she had a really good ski instructor once. And then she came back out of the bathroom and she was like, have the best life. And I was like, wow, what a lovely queen. Anyways. Americans are so friendly because we have fun accents. We're using a valet. We're getting lunch. Look, with this car's being taken to valet. That was the most random concept for a meal, but it was yummy. It was like a BLT with salmon as well. It was really good. I love Whole Foods. I don't love the New Zealand conversion rate, but like in general, the amount of stuff and options. Like if I was a wine bottle, I would look like this. Guys, you can see the us, the options are insane. It really is the best of both worlds, from a work call to immediately laying out by the sun to do some Good editing. Look. There's a lizard. Oh my god, it's so cute. I don't really want to scare it. Can we can we sit here peacefully together? I feel like we can. <gasps> it's so cute. Do you think it'll let me touch it? Should I try touch it? Oh, it ran away. I guess it's not an option. I sent Jenny this like cute little text because I was just like having a very grateful moment earlier and I was like a lot of what's happened in my life is like because Jenny like has chosen to believe in me and whatnot and anyway she sent me this like really cute text back. <laughs> now I'm here crying at the club. We are going to Miami. We're going on a road trip. Enjoy the vlog. <laughs> So good. It has five stars on Google reviews. They have 128 reviews. They're gonna have 129 after this. So good. I smuck her breakfast panini. So good. He tried to make her make it very slim because we're going on a road trip. But if anybody else is in Naples, you should go here. We've got beignets. We're gonna try them. Beignets beignets. Yeah, should we cheers them? Okay. Oh, we're really hot. Yeah, we're gonna be. 
in Miami. This is my room. It did have pretty towels on the end of the beds, but I piled them all up because I'm gonna have a nap. But vibes, look at this. Then you can see the pool from here. And I've got my bathroom. It's so pretty. Like, look at all the gold, like, detailing. Anyways, I'm gonna have a nap, and then we're gonna go to Soho House. We are at Miami Beach! Elda <laughs> has got a new hat! <laughs> They've got these funky little like, look at this, like a drinks refreshment cart. is literally so gorgeous. Everything's so Miami and I kind of love it. Uh. No Limits Miami, they just sold it. I kind of don't, but we just met the dude who runs it. Crazy. sunblock and LJ's car but like vibes of vibes of this outfit and just going to the Porsche to get out my sunblock you know manifesting a dream life or whatever like how freaking gorgeous is LJ's car I literally can't go over it gorgeous okay I'm going to the beach now that the sun's chilled out a little bit it's not super intensely warm but okay I'm just chilling out the beach and this Dude just came over and was like hello and I was like hello and he was like what you have Daniel and he shook his hand and was like I'm Bex I did not say that I said I'm Rebecca who am I kidding and then he was like how old are you and I was like 22 and then he asked my number and I was like I'm only here for 24 hours so no America cracks me up so I was like lying there again and then this dude came over to talk and was like you, have you been for a swim and I was like no he's gonna ask about the temperature and then we ended up just talking for like 30 minutes I love America hey it's not my beach I kind of want to stay and watch sunset but I'm cold so I think I'm gonna go back to the house and get warmer clothes and then come back and sit here because I've got an hour so I can go get food and stuff so that's the plan outfit makeup let's run back to the beach and see if there's any sunset Sunsets or sunrises, like does it not? And it's like a good one. Does it not just fill you with so much like gratitude and like inspiration? The problem is that I want to move everywhere. The problem is that I literally love everywhere. I could be a Miami girl. There is a bigger outside gym. Look at this one. Should we have a look? I'm literally wearing the completely wrong outfit for this, but let's have a look. Oh cool, it's like an outside Cali park. This is freaking dope. I don't think I'll be able to do a pull up. Should I try and do a pull up? I won't injure myself. Okay, let's manifest. The way you couldn't even see in that video. I wish I wasn't injured. What are these other things? like 
I love that pink on you. And I was like, thank you. And then, then I came out and I was standing there looking up where I'm gonna go. Um, Cause I got, there were too many options guys. There were too many options and I was hungry. And so the easiest way to solve all the issues was to go and Uber eat something. And then I walked past this pizza place and it smelled delicious and there was no line and it would have been ready so quickly. So I've gotten some takeaway pizza. I got two different flavors. Didn't think about the price, didn't think about anything. I was just like, fuck it, it looks yummy. Let's do it. And that's the energy of this trip. Anyways, before I went there, this other person um, came up to me. He's like, hey, what's your name? Because this dude was like, um, hey, where are you from? Blah, blah, blah. I was like, New Zealand. Uh, he's like, oh, you're just visitting. I was like, no, I got a one-way ticket. I'm not going back to New Zealand. Um, anyways, they're going dancing. He said he buy me a tequila. But the lovely trainer dude that I met on the beach, he finished his work at like 1 a.m. No, I don't think I can stay at 1 a.m. But I do my makeup so good. Did pretty. Kind of slaying here, I'm not gonna lie. I just feel like a prettier, more elevated version of myself. And that's on getting out of New Zealand. <laughs> it is officially day three in Miami and we're going to the beach to start the day. It's Sunday. Linda's gone and ordered a full on like uh, shaded tent set up. It's <laughs> now we have an umbrella too. It's so fishy, look at this. <laughs> Do we need any more shade? Guys, look, there's a, we're just chilling. There's like not really anything to look at. And then you look over and there's just this big floating billboard that is literally so funny. The fact that it's electrical seems like the bear has it. <laughs> Linda's trying um, Rancho's Nachoros. <laughs> look at this top, it's so gorgeous. I just found vanilla coke for the first time since I've been in America. We need this. Look how weird the packaging is. I was literally just talking to LJ about how I haven't found it anywhere. I put it back. Also, how interesting are these screens? Because it gets like, the, it fogs up because of the temperature difference. I've burnt my elbows. Okay, we went down to go look at those like clothing stores. Some of the stuff was beautiful. Some of it was like cheap, average. I'm coming back to you like cabanas before they take it away. Hey. It's like your coaching. <laughs> Hi, I'm Caleb. I live in Miami. You guys should come here. It's amazing. If you need training at the outside gym that's free, <laughs> he will train you. <laughs> we just got back from the beach. Now we're in the pool. Uh, and that's our apartment. We only have one shower that works. Well, that's warm. So Aljo's currently in the shower in the bathroom in my room and I'm waiting for her to give me a sign that she's done or I can go back up. It is so beautiful here. Yeah, I really like Miami. I really like Miami. But I also really like everywhere else, so <laughs> it's giving biased. to the house, the apartment. We've had Cuban music, we've had Cuban food. Dancing. Yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Better done by the professionals. <laughs> Next time in the travel vlogs, there's a few more days of Florida before I fly to New York to explore and spend some time with Thea. See you next week for another video. Bye.